So to download and install NordVPN, it's actually very simple. So the first thing we need to do is to go to our internet browser and you want to go to nordvpn.com. Alternatively, I will leave an affiliate link in the description in case you want to get yourself a discount and support the channel at the same time. But once we are on the homepage, it's going to tell you a lot more about NordVPN and what it can do. However, because we want to install it, all we need to do is go to the top drawer to where it says download VPN and click on that. From here, you want to scroll down slightly and it's going to give you all of the devices you can use NordVPN for. So you just want to select your device, in this case Windows, and then you want to click on the download app option. You then want to save the app somewhere on your computer, so in this case I'm going to use my desktop. So once we've got the installer downloaded to our desktop, you just want to double click it to run it, and it will ask you for admin permissions, so you want to select yes. Once you've done that, it will pop up with the installer. So all you need to do now is select the directory to where you want to install the VPN. In this case, I'm going to use the default one and select next. It will then begin to install the application. This can take anywhere from a few seconds to a few minutes, depending on your computer speed. Once it's done, you want to select whether you want the desktop shortcut menu or start menu. Then you want to select next. You then want to click install and then it will begin to install the VPN. And again, this can take anywhere from a few seconds to a few minutes, depending on your computer. Once it's done, it's going to give you the option to install the NordVPN browser extension, which is probably recommended, but in the case of this tutorial, I'm going to deselect this option and click on next. You would then be prompted to restart your computer, so you just want to select one of these options and click on finish. Okay, so once you've restarted your computer, you can go ahead and launch NordVPN. So once NordVPN launches, it will prompt you to log on with an account. So if you don't have an account, you want to click on create NordVPN account, otherwise you just want to log in just as you normally would. Once you're logged into your account, you can go ahead and start using NordVPN just as you normally would. And that's it. So if you have any questions or comments, leave them below and I'll reply to you as soon as I can.